Well, hello everyone, I'm Yanni from PU for You Gaming, and today we are back in Garden Paws. Uh, oh, wow, look at all this stuff. How did we get all that? <laughs> oh, wow, it is amazing how quickly you can fill up. We even have, well, we should have the max size inventory right now. So it's kind of amazing how quickly that fills up. Uh, maybe not when it comes to a hoarder like me. Um, um, yeah, I yeah, don't really have room. Well, we're gonna need these very soon. Let's just put them right there for the time being. And actually, let's pull some wood out. I don't know how much we need, but I did say that I needed, I needed, I needed some of this. This one is the biggest, right? Hold 40 items. This one only holds 30. I do like having a mix just for the variety, right? Um, but this one is definitely the better one. It's also the more expensive one to craft, but that's fine. Let's just do it so that we don't have to keep struggling because we are gonna have to, we're gonna get more wings, right? For one, plus all the other new stuff that we keep getting. So. Uh, we can definitely use some more. Um, might we put you over here? Uh, it must be this way around, yes. Okay, you can actually put it all the way into the wall. I don't really want to do that, but something that looks about right. Nice. Yep, so now we have all that extra space. Oh, yes. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, which reminds me. Let's just go here and we are going to put this away. I know it's such a cool cape. It is such a cute, cool cape. Let's just grab some of this stuff and we are going to put it all over here because we're going to have more. I'm trying to keep these kind of together, all the butterfly wings. So uh, we're going to get more of those, but there we go. Nice. Okay, so now we have more room for that. And oh, that was actually... Yep, now that we're at it, um, let's also do this. So we need eight wooden poles and we need ten wooden boards and then we're going to need some stone blocks. So let's grab these. Let's just grab the stone out of here. Uh, no more stone in there. Cool. And then we are going to make eight of these craft lovely okay so now we have an extra stone storage uh only thing is well you know what we are gonna i was thinking about going to get my item shifter but you know what i think we're just gonna do it just gonna huh oh it's because i'm standing next to one of these and we're just gonna put it right there and then we're gonna grab uh, well, let's just grab as much of this as we can, and then if I can, huh? Why can I access this one? All right, okay. Let's walk away. Sometimes you just have to walk away a little bit to kind of let it realize that you actually put something. Uh, there we go. Or oh, place something here, right? So there we go. Let's put all of these. In here so the full one is kind of the one at the back there we go because this is the one I would usually kind of be filling stuff into and I don't use wood uh, stone that much so because it's gonna be a little if I have to go over here every time right so I think it it would be nice to just have this one there we go okay let's put all of that back so now we have extra stone storage we have extra clothing storage uh, lovely that all helps that all helps let's put you there let's put some stuff in there. Um, probably have the tall grass in that one. And then we have the honey. Do we have anything new that has arrived here? Yes, I had a feeling. Because I feel like I put, you can actually store more in the owl than you can store in here, right? It has more slots. And I had a feeling we had put enough that some of it would still be a left over a little bit there. Cool. Okay, what do I have over here? Let's put the small fish in there so I don't have to... Go. Oh, we have the seaweed in here, actually. Oh, nice. Cool. Well, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just leave it there. So, 
that was all that sorted out. We got some crafting done. That is awesome. Oh, I've got some more stuff going on here. Cool. Let's just pull it out so that I don't forget that I have it. Put them in there. That's another 1300. Not bad. And yes, Roman, I know what you're thinking right now. Uh, that uh, if I sold that, I would have enough for the tree farm. But I'm not going for the tree farm right now. Um, Roman always really, really, really wants me to go for the tree farm. Yep, so I'm expecting a comment about that. There we go. So just trying to get ahead of you a little bit. Yep. Uh, but that is not what I want. Well, we could still sell it, but I don't really want to wait around for that. Nope. So we got a yellow angel fish, which is good. I was thinking we need to do some fishing to try and complete that quest because the only thing we're missing is these. We just need three more and then we can actually complete this um, axolotl fish uh, or quest with puppy. So that brings us to 12. That's not bad. That's enough for four days. Uh, yep. So let's... Do I not have any of these seeds? I guess I don't. Okay. Well, there we go. I have so many different seeds. I can't even... Huh. Do I have, like, duplicates? Maybe. Somewhere. <laughs> Since I can't even um, put anything more in here. But there are so many. Okay, you can go in there. You can do it in there. Okay, it's just because I didn't trigger the right one. Yep. And they are close together. Then that is a problem. Okay, so let's put this here. And then let's try and get this done now. Let's try and finally get this done. Because I've had this for days. Still thorn that wants it. Cool. Let's go and do it. Let's go and do it. Before I get distracted by anything else. Ooh. And we're just going to quickly pop out here. And oh, let's grab you. And some more goodies. Nice. I like it. Okay. There we go, 250 gold from that, not bad. I just wanted to see, yeah, Flo still hasn't appeared. We haven't been able to do the trick-or-treating with Flo. Um, hmm, because she's not around. Okay, well, that's fair. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's pop down here, grab this, thank you. And then uh, let's head into town because we do need to um try and buy something but on the other hand i also really wanted to hoard a few things get some more sunflowers because it's gonna be well three seasons before we can get more of them except if we buy some seeds or find something right but still we're not gonna get any from the wild for a while Do -do -do. I wonder if we're going to get any more quests with Kieran, because I don't feel like we've really had anything here unless, or except in the very first uh, beginning of the first year, right, when you're setting up the camp. It would have been kind of nice to get some more quests out there, but maybe we will eventually. Mm. So it was a little bit more spread out, because I feel like that's how I've felt so far. That is like you do a series of quests when they arrive, or when you arrive first, of course, then... Uh, well, even when they arrive, because Kieran is Kieran there in the beginning. I don't think Kieran is there right away. Uh, but I can't remember. I think he appears after a few days or something when you start out the game, if I remember correctly. Um, and then you kind of get to do a few quests. And the same for Elizabeth. When you buy the, the flower shop, you get to do a few quests and then that's it. You don't really get to interact with them anymore. Uh, except, of course, doing something like trigger treating. Um, but it would be nice to get some more quests from them, I feel like. That's just me. I just... So I'm kind of hoping that we will later. And then, of course, you have the, the earthquake in year two, which, of course, gives uh, a f series of quests with everybody, which is really cool. But I was kind of hoping there would be more like that. But we are still in year two, so maybe when we get into year three, there will be another batch of quests like that. I'm really looking forward to seeing that. Yep. 
Because I haven't really played that much further than this. What are we? We're in year two. It's fall. I don't really remember if I've ever gotten into year three. Maybe the beginning of it or something before I started over. So um, we're kind of getting to the point where most things are going to be new for me. Which is cool. Which is cool. Yep. There we go. Okay. Ordered some stuff again. Lovely. Okay. So let's see. No more new quests. Even Conrad, I'm so surprised I'm not getting any new bulk quests. That is so weird. Why am I not getting any of those? I know he was talking about getting a new boat. Or a new ship, a bigger ship. Uh, which should give us an option to do even bigger requests. And then, hmm. I think we got one request after that and then nothing more. Let's see what you have for sale today. Mm. Oh, this is cool. Red spooky cape. That looks pretty cool, actually. Nice. And a pumpkin body. I like it. See, there's like no quests from ev anyone. Uh, not really seeing anything over there either. Anyone up here? No. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I forgot. I wanted to. I actually wanted to bring the butterflies to get the next set of wings. Mm hmm. That's what happens when you have way too much going on in your head, then you forget half of it. Okay, well, let's go up here. This is the most important. Let's see. We can get a shop upgrade, but I'm rarely even filling up my shop when I do sell stuff. So I don't really feel like that's that necessary. Um, not really the living room. Barn could be an option if we wanted to raise some more animals. I'm kind of thinking the horse stable. Oh, it's 25,000. I thought it was 20,000, but that's fine. Um, there's also Zero's upgrade. But I'm kind of thinking if this might trigger some quests. Or at least a little bit of quests. And of course, it will give us the option to, well, tame horses. And if we ever come across the the rare um, rainbow one, then we have an option there. So let's grab this. And then we have 4,000... I don't think that's enough to buy anything in that I want from over here. Glass, 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 neon, 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 not really. Alphabet, nope. This would be one that I would maybe want to try and get. Uh, just so we start producing even more honey and things. Mm, nope. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Most of this is like decorative stuff, so I'm not really in a hurry to get any of it. Another breeding pen would be nice, but I don't really feel like I can afford doing a bunch more of that. There's also the super shed, but it just takes up so much space. That's the main reason why I haven't really prioritized it. It's nice because you can store a lot in it, but it also takes up a lot of space and... Uh -huh. But we might try and get this soon. And then this one, of course, see, I was running out of seed storage. So that would be good. It might be something to do. But I also really want to up upgrade more of that stuff from, from Frank just to kind of get it going. Um, okay, but then we have to wait. I didn't see if it was one or two days. And I'm kind of wondering where it's going to go. Come to think of it, I was kind of thinking that we're going to get the... The one that we can craft and place ourselves, just like we've been doing with the like the forest habitat and many of the other habitats. Uh, and even for the, the chicken coop and stuff, you get an option to make a smaller version. And I was kind of thinking of that because I was thinking about the, the, the rainbow mount, right? Uh, but I do think that we also get a stable that oh it's going gonna no 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 um all right i have this place over here i completely forgot i do not have anything in here mm. why did i even put that there i wanted to put a f duckling in there right did i not have any more no i don't no nope. okay or well, maybe we just made one to made one, make one. I don't really remember. I remember putting the duckling or the, one of the ducks in here to see if they would go there, I think. Uh, but anyway, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a 
bar or a a stable somewhere but in the on the other map it actually goes right here so we might have to move all of this and that's why i'm kind of pondering if it's a two days so that i'll get a warning as to where it's gonna go mm. hmm well i guess we'll find out won't we yeah, so far I'm not really seeing anywhere that it's marking that it will go, but I'm kind of wondering if I'm going to have to move these things. Okay, well, anyway, that is just a surprise for tomorrow. Let's see if I can get this. Thank you. Huh? And what time is it? It's five o'clock. Mm, well, we have a lot of energy to you so let's burn off some of that let's just get some more wood because i've been burning through a lot of it i was also thinking about doing some fishing not quite sure where we can get the yellow angel fish if we have to f does that count as a rare one i don't think it counts as a rare one i think we can get it from just fishing anywhere where well i think you can get any most of the fish from even the rare ones you can get by just by fishing in the open waters but if you want to have a good a very good chance of getting a rare one you have to fish in the the glitter 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 schools right the little um special schools and then of course there's all the new ones that you can get from the chum schools but i think the yellow angel fish is more like just a, a common f or s rare fairly common fish so you can get it just from fishing in just about any spot just like we can with the small fish it's just feels a little rarer than the small fish maybe and the snappers of course hmm okay well let's whoop, get this there we go pretty obvious i haven't really spent that much time on the fishing so i'm no expert in how that all works but here we go. That's just my impressions from what I remember. Okay, we are running out. Lovely. Let's grab that. Can I get this one? Nice. Okay, so I can get one more thing, I think. Boom. Yes. Okay, so now that is sorted. And tomorrow is the last day of fall. Was Did we have to go and talk to the mayor? I can never remember which season it is where he has like a come back and talk to me at the end of the season and i don't remember if it's now or it's for christmas or during winter mm. okay well let's just put a few things away and then we are gonna pop right down here let's just do a little bit while we have some time and see what we get i do have the fish bait on me so it should be fine Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got a goldfish. That would be one that we can definitely get from this, but I'm pretty sure we can also get the yellow angelfish and we got the blue fish. Mm -hmm. And we got a box. Yes. So that was neat and then of course we can get something like this soggy paper so that's another option i could also try and upgrade my tools some more that would be another thing we need money for right i could try and get a better fishing rod which should maybe help a little bit with the fishing hmm. oh look at that so pretty so pretty okay i'm not having <laughs> much in luck with this that's for sure okay well we're getting some seaweed mm -hmm. so far i'm having more luck luck getting yellow angels from mumble and maybe maybe from the traps did we get one from the traps the fish aren't biting okay let's try again Mm. Oh, 
small fish. Well, that's not bad because we need a lot of them. Whew. Well, we almost have enough for one penguin. <laughs> but the uh, deliveries from McCoy is definitely gonna help. That is that is really a nice upgrade. I like that because otherwise you're gonna need so much. Why does it feel like there's a quest over there? Did I miss one when I was in town? Uh, or is it just the text over? Or it might just be the text. I think that's Elizabeth we can see over there, maybe. I think it might, might just be the text over the head, like we can see it for Frank. Uh, okay, so we... I'm gonna try and go for that. So, I might be all the way over by Mooney and Company. Okay, we have enough room, so... Let's just go for it. Uh, well, she does. All oh, right, now I know what it is. It's because I can't see it on my. Um, it's not on the list, right? They still have that little box. So when you get the the uh, what's it called, the bulletin board quest, it doesn't actually show on the right hand side. But we did pick one up. Or some, I think it was pink leaves or something. And that was probably for Elizabeth. And uh, where did that star go? Um, can we see it? Uh, nope. Maybe it went much further out than I thought. I am definitely not really seeing it. But sometimes it goes all the way out into the ocean out here, so... Hmm. Oh, let's just try and go and look. There we go. All right, all right, all right. We have another cave here. So we have two caves here, plus the one in town. Technically, we have more caves than we have on the other map, don't we? Um, in town, well, in town on the other map, we have the one with the, with the shortcut. Uh, where you can go out to yep it's all the way out there campsite right there's one underneath the miners and then there's the one with all the plant fiber underneath alberto on the old map isn't that all the caves that we have in town there well this is not really in town but i kind of consider it part of the town anyway um probably because this cave is um is here is out here wasn't this the one this is the one with the shortcut right um that one is pretty much right in the middle of the town on the other map so that might be why that cave was missing that i was confused about but i just feel like i've just seen it i feel like i've just seen it <laughs> like you know recently and it's been how long has it been it's been like a year i don't know it was sometime last year i think that i started this series so it's been probably almost a year since I played the old map. So it feels weird that it would be that I have just seen that cave. Or maybe I just completely missed it last time. I don't know. I'm so confused. I'm still, that is still on my mind. <laughs> but of course, I just recorded that other video like half an hour ago. So anyway, but yeah, that was it for today, guys. We bought the stable. So we're going to have to see where it's going to end up. I'm kind of hoping that they're going to have a little outline like they usually do for when you buy the barn. You have a few days to kind of move things out of the way. And the same for, for, um, for instance, the, the dogs in town, you have a little outline, right? Um, but it didn't really show one, but I think maybe it doesn't show until the next day. And then you have you know, and a day or two to move things, but we'll see. So uh, yeah, thank you for watching. And as always, do take care and happy gaming.